Henrik, your body language after that win sort of says it all, but put into words what this means to you. It means a lot. You know, uh, you put in a lot of effort into every game here, and uh, it's not done until you put that last puck in. Uh, it was a series that it was two teams, they didn't give much. You know, Price was playing really well, and, and we didn't get any anything for free, and it was kind of what the message going into this game, too. Uh, you know, it's not going to be uh, handed to us in any way, and, and we had to work really hard until the end here to get it done. And It's just exciting and, and uh, a great feeling uh, to do it in front of our fans. Uh, you know, that, that excitement when you, you realize that the puck goes in and, and you're moving on. Um, it's been pretty intense the last few days, but it's all worth it. You make the save on Plakanitz with a little over a minute left. Take us through that play. Did you know he was there? No, no, not really. I knew I was in trouble because the, I wasn't in good position in, in the first play, and he threw it at me. So I, I, I was, my first thought was, don't knock it in. And then when he ends up right on his stick, uh, it was just a desperation save, and luckily he didn't put it far corner. Uh, it was just a, a quick play. So. Uh, you know, you, you, I knew with, with two minutes to go, it's going to be one or two more saves. Uh, and, and if I can come up with those, we're going to be in good shape. And um, The whole series, though, it, it was a lot of fun to play because the, the, the guys played so hard with a lot of structure in front and made it, um, you know, so much easier for, for me to focus on my game and, and try to do my part. So it was a great feeling to see the, the way we worked and, and Especially the way we battled back the last couple of games. What do you think, James, between the first period and the, and the last two? Well, you've seen in almost every game where uh, you know one team starts well and then it's going to be uh, the other team's going to battle back. It's just hockey; it works like that. It's hard to play a dominant 60-minute hockey game. So we felt like we, we could do a lot a lot of things better in the second, and we did. We we had more jump and. Uh, we were skating more, we were winning more battles, and, and uh, made it really tough for them in their, in their own end. So, uh, great way to answer after the first. Given how physical this series was, how much will you guys covet this rest, and how much will you watch Boston and Ottawa if only to start scouting? Oh, well, like I said, every game here, uh, it's pretty exhausting and it's so intense, as it should be. Uh, so the next uh, couple of days will be important to just relax and, and recharge mentally and, and physically. And, and, and then you start focusing on the next round. You know, you, you need to start over and, and realize how much um, work you have in front of you if you want to move on to the next one. And it um, doesn't matter who we face, obviously. There are two teams that they wouldn't be in this position if they were not playing good hockey and then they work hard. So uh, I expect a. Uh, you know, a tough series moving forward. How much did it help getting out of that first period, matching that desperation, coming out only one nothing? Yeah. To be able to go out the second. Yeah, I, I think um, as long as you can keep the game uh, pretty close, uh, you know it can turn. As a goalie, um, I saw what happened last game up in Montreal. They they had a lot of puck and energy the first half of that game. And um, we didn't get hurt. We were just down 2-1, and then we scored that second goal. And the whole game changed after that. Third period in overtime was our game. And um, so you just need to realize that. When, when they keep coming and coming, just uh, make sure you don't get hurt. And then we're going to regroup. And, and sooner or later, this will turn. And, and it did again today. Uh, our second period was probably our best period in, in this series. You and Dan Girardi have been through a lot. And you know how much he sacrifices for the team. <sighs> yeah. Just how about the series he had at this one? Well, I always know what to expect from him. I've had the pleasure to play with him for a lot of years now, and he always uh, put his body in front and, and pay the price in every situation. And, and uh, as a goalie, uh, you can't ask for more than that. And it's it's a great feeling to have guys in front of you that are ready to do that, especially this time of the year. And, and I appreciate everything he does for, for this team. So it's been a lot of fun to, to do it together. How much more pressure was it after losing game three at home to come back? Uh, well, I think it's important not to overreact, and, and uh, we knew we were close. We were doing a lot of good things, um, and, and I said it earlier. It, it was a series where no team really gave the other team anything. You had to earn it by working hard and gain the momentum. It was no, you know, goals that were handed to you really. So, um, but you could really see how games turned 
it was a couple plays that changed a lot and 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 the momentum changed and that's uh, that's playoff hockey so I, I think we understood that we didn't get hurt up in Montreal a few times where we were struggling and and then uh, when it turned we, we cashed in and, and that was the key in the series to take advantage of the momentum swings going into the series everyone talked about the goalie matchup and that's one guy. I know the handshake lines they're brief but what did yep. you get a chance to say to Price? No I you know what I have a lot of respect for for Kerry he, he, uh, he's he been uh, the top goal in the league now for a lot of years, and I knew going into this series, um, you know, I, I'm going to have to play my best. I said it going into this series, uh, pretty okay, pretty good. It's going to not make it. It's not going to be good enough. So I felt really good in this series. I felt like uh, I was focusing on my game. Uh, the guys were playing with a lot of structure in front of me and made it easier. Easier to play the game. It was it was a fun series. Uh, yeah. Last one, last one. That's it. We were still doing English here. Yeah. <laughs> Translate for us. <laughs> All right, that's it. Thank you.